Welcome to Check Talk Tuesdays with ASW. I'm Ben Harmon, and uh, today we're going to be talking about lighting. So uh, we thought it'd be good to you know, start with the basics of lighting. You know, what is lighting? Why do we do it? Well, hopefully, lighting is kind of obvious. You know, you take lights, you turn them on, and you know, you get light for yourself and whatever you're doing. You know, your event or your uh, your home maybe or your conference room. Um, but you know why? Why do we light things? You know why do we have all this gear for it? You know you turn a light on and it's on, right? Well, you know sometimes there's a little bit more to it than that, and uh, we thought it'd be good to kind of cover some of those basics. So, um, you know why? Why do we light things? You know, well, you know obviously there's the part where you know our eyes need light to see. So uh, having light can be useful if you wanted to look around. Um, you know if you weren't. Uh, your audience may be uh, in a production to be able to see what's going on. Uh, you're going to need some lights to do that. You know, but lighting can be so much more than that too. You know, you can really create an, uh, an atmosphere and an experience with lighting. Um, you know, you can do things. You know, theater is a great example of this, where maybe you get like a, a blue cold light. You know, for a, a dramatic scene, or you know, maybe you have flashes of light for some, some dramatic events that happen. Um, and it's just a great way to really engage your audience in what's going on in your production. Um, so you can do some amazing things in that way. <clears throat> the other thing that's great about lighting too is uh, when you wanted to record something, cameras are uh, not quite as good as our eyes at picking up low light oftentimes. Though they're getting better all the time, uh, it's really great for cameras to have lots of light. So uh, if you wanted to record something, you want to make sure you have lots of light. Um, and so that's, that's another reason why you might want to consider having a lot of lighting. So that being said, you know, what, what are some of the, the basic elements of lighting? Well, in a, many a new you know, modern systems, you have a controller of some kind, uh, normally running off a protocol called DMX, uh, and then you have light fixtures. Um, so we've got a couple light fixtures we just picked up from the shop here. Um, so this is maybe a, a classical PAR can, um, which you might would consider you know, just a simple light. You know, it's got one plug, you, know, you plug it in, it turns on, it's got a bulb in it, it makes light. Um, right here we've got a filter holder so you could put colors in there or diffusers. Um, it's a really useful you know, way to, to get a little bit of harsh functionality out of it. But still a very, very simple light, kind of on off, you know, um, just wash, you know, general wash. Uh, here we have maybe a little bit more modern version of that, uh, that light. Uh, so this one has power as well as DMX control. Um, it, uh, it's got multiple colors, it's got different features like strobing and, and all kinds of things built into it. Um, so that's kind of like the next step up of a wash maybe. Um, here we've got a mover. So movers, uh, as you can tell, they, they move around. So this is really cool. You can get some, some great effects by you know, swinging lights around. You, know, you can use one or two fixtures to cover a lot of different spaces, which is really nice. If, you know, you need to have lots of different areas, but you don't want to have too many lights. Uh, you can use these to kind of fill the gap there. Um, there's a couple other types of lights as well that we don't have here. You know, lipsodials, they're a little bit more narrow. Uh, you kind of use them to focus down, often used in theatrical lighting for um, different, uh, you know, areas. You group into areas, um, as well as, you know, different effects you can get, like lasers. Uh, you can get fog machines that run on lighting protocols. There's a lot of different types of lights. You know, if, if you can dream of it, there's probably a light that can make it happen. Um, so those are just some of the, the lighting fixtures and the basics of lighting. I'm Ben Harmon. You're here at ASW Tech Talk Tuesday. Thank you for watching, and we'll catch you next time.